Welcome to a special edition of In The News. The Show Me City is home to many amazing youths, and amongst them is Chloe Joyner, who already at the age of eight has found a way to give back to the community through the love of books. So far, I've collected over, well, over 10,000 books. Meet Chloe Joyner, the founder of a Book and a Smile initiative. She has set a goal of collecting 1 million books to give the gift of learning, confidence, and imagination to everyone in the community. These are some of the books we had over here. I got started collecting books when we were um, picking my sister up from her school and we saw an officer stopping somebody over by the road. And then my Nana said that <clears throat> maybe we, we should go say hi. And then I said no because I'm, I'm scared, and then he say, she said, um, there's no reason to be scared because like the officers are supposed to help us. So then we found her name, Officer Barry, and um, where she, what police office she was at, and then we went to drop off some books. Chloe figured that the police officers could give kids books to make them feel more comfortable and build trust. And then once we got home, my my Nana also got, she said, oh, maybe we should start um, a project out of this. And we, we were going through names, and then I said, um, a book and a smile. I love to read. When, I'm in, when I read books, it's like Tangled or something. Like, you can imagine yourself in that place. And also, especially since the pandemic started, people couldn't really go places. So like, you could like just, Imagine yourself in that book. I would like to collect and give um, a million books to a million kids. As a reward for her incredible work in the community, Mayor Ellicott made Chloe junior mayor for the day. All right, Chloe, this is your day, right? Awesome. I get to sit on the chair. Come on, you're gonna be over here. <laughs> Thank so you're going to be the mayor today, so what do you want to do today? Tell me what you're going to do today. Um, I'm Chloe, I'm junior, junior mayor, and I'm ready for a meeting today. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Well, I mean, she's a superstar, right? <laughs> so, what you've done, you know, starting off with your million books, it's a big deal to the kids, right? We want to set you as an example of Missouri City kind of show the rest of the kids that what you're doing is important because education, right, reading, it's, it's a big deal. Not a lot of people do that these days anymore. And the knowledge <laughs> is power, right? Yes. <laughs> yes. First, I think it's going to um, help them by inspiring them to also help the community. And that's one thing that's really big about it, too. And I also think it's going to help them to, like, encourage them to read. Well, how about if we give uh, a book to you? Oh. Submit a book to you. Would you like that? Yeah, that would be cool. So I'll show you. Let's do this. Mayor Ellicott presented the junior mayor with two signed copies of Missouri City's historical books with a special note inside for Chloe, encouraging her to continue her work in the community. So what do you think? Is it a boring job? No, I think <laughs> it's really cool. <laughs> uh, so. I'm excited to join her on her mission and her drive to one million books that she's trying to accomplish for, the, uh, for her goal. Help Chloe reach her goal of a million books by joining us on June 27th for the Community Book drive through at City Hall from 2 to 4 p.m. So I look forward to seeing you at the City Hall drive and join me, but join our superstar <laughs> to make that drive. I want books for all ages, something that can teach you a lesson in the books and something that'll just make you smile. You can bring one book or you can bring 10 books. It doesn't really matter, but just make sure that you come out and support the superstar that we <laughs> have right here in our home, own hometown, Missouri City. And once again, I look forward to seeing you all. And if you have any problems today, Coley gets to answer those problems. <laughs> I'm out. <laughs> <laughs>
As we wrap up in the news, we would like to remind you to join us for the MCTX Independence Day Festival on July 3rd at the Houston Community College, Missouri City campus. This free family fun festival includes kid action zones, community performances, food trucks, and live entertainment, including headliners, hip hop band, CNC Music Factory, and tag team. To end the night, Watch as the HEB fireworks show lights up the Missouri City skies. For more information, visit MissouriCityTX.gov. Thanks for watching in the news. I'm Lindsay Westmoreland. Keep watching MCTV for more city updates.